This is section 2.5 on midpoints. We're going to start with a couple of examples. First one, Mr. Lindy scored an average. <laughs> no, Mr. Lindy scored an 87 and a 93 on two tests. What is his test average? How do you average two numbers? Well, you would add them and you would divide by two. However number, many numbers you have, you add them and divide by that many number of numbers. Second one, Mr. Podrowski's fantasy football team scored 140 points in week one and 80 points in week two. On average, how many points has his team scored the first two weeks? Again, you're averaging two numbers, so you would add those and divide by two. So it looks like this. 87 and 93, add those together first, and you get 180. When you divide by two, you get 90. 90 makes sense as an answer because it's in between 87 and 93. It's directly in between. It's three units away from 93 and three units away from 87. That's what an average is. For the second one, you're adding 80 and 140, and you're going to end up with 220. And when you divide that by two, you get 110. Is 110 reasonable for an average? Sure, it's in between these two values. Even more, it's directly in between. 110 is 30 points from 140, and it's 30 points from 80. If you were to type this into your calculator, you need to be very, very careful. Sometimes, if you just type in 87 plus 93, and you don't put it in parentheses, and then hit divide by two, the way the calculator is going to read this is, it's going to take 93 divided by two first, because it knows order of operations, and then add 87. And when you do that, that gives you 133.5. Is that a reasonable answer? for an average of two numbers. It's not because it's so much bigger than both of them. The average, remember, is directly in between the two values. So when you go to type it in the calculator, you need to make sure that you do this instead. You need to tell the calculator what you need done first. So 87 plus 93, you need that to be first. So you put it in parentheses. And you divide by two. And that gives you 90. Now, is 90 reasonable? Yeah, it's in between those two. 